A nonprofit is hoping to reduce the number of overdoses and deaths in Bibb County by educating people on the dangers of drugs. According to the State Department of Public Health, more than 2,600 Georgians died from overdoses in 2022. Camila Williams talked with members of Beyond the Bell about the reasons behind their Thursday night town hall and what they hope to accomplish. They saw a lady in the car lean over and she ran to get her Narcan. Lavinia Sadler has heard the stories of people close to death. The lady came back. But the story about how Narcan spray worked made her realize how important it is to save a life. It empowered me to um, to press, to, to do what all I can do to help our city. Sadler works for Beyond the Bell, a nonprofit educating kids in Macon, Bibb County on the dangers of drugs and underage drinking. She says community leaders and health organizations will talk Thursday about prevention and why saying no is best. It, it just saw a crisis, a pandemic looked like going on with this OD and on prescription drugs and street drugs. In 2022, Bibb, Houston, Lawrence, Baldwin, and Peach County reported 105 total overdose deaths. Glenn Keith Phillips says Bibb County needs to talk about drug prevention for the youth, too. It's, that's another big um, way middle schoolers are, uh, are smoking and vaping. When will fentanyl get into that? Sadler says the most important thing is educating yourself and learning how to help someone who needs it. It might not touch you directly, but indirectly, you would know what to do if you're in a grocery store, on the street, uh, shopping in a mall. And Sadler doesn't want to hear another story of someone being close to death. In Macon, Camila Williams, 13 WMAZ News. Tomorrow's town hall starts at 6 o'clock at the Bloomfield Gilead Rec Center. It is free and open to the public. Now, Sadler says Beyond the Bell also goes to Bibb County Schools and Rec Centers to talk about drug and alcohol prevention.